particularly when these run shops are open, it's areas where you have schools. Mm, yeah. And mm -hmm. really, really concerned about that. Mm -hmm. And I make no bones, I, I, mean, I don't know one day I may just decide to, 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 to seriously um, engage the community in a discussion mm -hmm. about it. Um, because I know, I know some young people after school, uh, they would then uh, uh, just change the, 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 the school ship mm. and go in the bar, go in these cafes and we we'll take it over as well for it for us. We need to, to take mm -hmm. control of it now. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to continue to raise that issue. Mm -hmm. Okay, Minister, you, you're exceptionally busy. If there's one thing that's coming across, you're deeply rooted within the community that you represent. And the community can see tangible improvements over the course of just under two years that you've been their representative. Um, I also have to confess that uh, I take a peek at what you do on Facebook because you have, a, you have your own Facebook profile. Yeah. And um, there are pictures there that testify to everything that you've said, mm -hmm. the, the community outreach initiatives, the, the lighting and the, the, all the efforts are, uh, are recorded like there. I just mm -hmm. have to continue. Mm -hmm. I don't think I am as fast as you guys are <laughs> putting out the information, but um, yeah. I think it's, this is one of the areas I think probably uh, you need to emphasize the focus mm -hmm. on getting the information out. Mm -hmm. but, and as you said rightly, a lot has been done, but again there's still so much to do. And, mm -hmm. People are not easily satisfied. They feel that the government needs to solve every problem and solve it now. <laughs> yes. You know, we have some water issues, and I know that the Minister of Public Utilities is, um, is working and getting some of these water problems resolved. Yeah. I have confidence that um, well, we can do so much. The important thing is that you do your best, you keep in touch with your people. I have continued to keep in touch with my community. Don't mind there's two cities here. <laughs> I every Saturday morning there mm -hmm. I walk my area, mm -hmm. sitting as parts of the area. Saturday mornings I have devoted it, devoted that time to walking. Mm -hmm. If I don't walk on a Saturday morning, mm -hmm. when I come from church on a Sunday, I walk on certain parts on a Sunday afternoon, mm -hmm. at least three hours. Mm -hmm. Every Thursday we continue to meet with the communities in Bahatari and San Juan. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes it takes us into, well most of the times, when we leave there at night, people want to know how we do it. <laughs> uh, we leave there at 12, 12 mm -hmm. at night. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and yet the people will still say that it's true. Right? So, mm -hmm. But that only gives you more and more fuel mm -hmm. to work because you realize that there's still so many needs to satisfy. And, um, and I, I, I must say that I I have some very yes good people within the community. Mm -hmm. I have to thank always thank thank God for the, 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 the different church groups within the community. They, they have been very supportive. Mm -hmm. I don't say church, I'm not all. Oh, yeah. all, all, all. Mm -hmm. Christian, Muslim, Catholic, Muslim. That there have been a lot of support for the community to get things done. Um, there'll be those who criticize you every day, but that should just put you on to achieve more. That's all I look at it. I don't take the, I do not take these things personally. Like last night at a cottage meeting in Mexico uh, and Shaki Bonjour. I had a number of people. And that's something that I've been holding continuously. Once mm -hmm. every month I hold a cottage meeting in different parts of the area. Mm -hmm. Last night we had about, that's about, about 40 or people. Mm -hmm. And we um, had some young guys who came in and they came in with their own agenda to make noise for <laughs> jobs. Right. And we tried to listen to them because inside they are voting. Yeah. And I think the problem has been guidance. Mm -hmm children living but they have no work mm -hmm. and so on. But that only happens when you have been misguided mm -hmm. from your early life. Mm -hmm. So I think we need to 
emphasize within the constituency now. Mm -hmm. We need to provide that kind of counseling and guidance mm -hmm. to the young people and this is one of the things I hope to do, use the um, community centers mm -hmm. to do, policy clubs mm -hmm. um, making in roads in the area mm -hmm. and um, the, cons the community policing. Mm -hmm. They have been doing a marvelous job mm -hmm. in terms of counseling young people. If it can spread, that would be nice. It can change be a better place and the country, mm -hmm. the country as a whole will be a better place for all of us. Mm -hmm. Wow. I'd invite you to come to one of our participants. Mm -hmm. I look forward to it, Minister. Minister, thank you so much for your time today. It's been an enlightening chat. And I hope those in the online community now could appreciate just how difficult and how challenging, yet at the same time how rewarding a job can be. Thank you, sir.